What's up guys, it's Aaron Nitmar. Welcome back to another Smash 4 Mod Showcase. Today, we're going to be doing a little bit, some, something a little bit different. We're going to be playing us two different mods, the Paper Mario mod and the Paper Luigi mod. So if you guys are hyped for this video, do me a huge favor and hit the like button down below. And of course, we'll, we will be starting with Paper Mario, who is, uh... He looks a little weird being in 3D, obviously. He's meant to be 2D. Um, hopefully, once we figure out how to apply Game & Watch's, uh flatness to other characters he will look much better but he still looks pretty good um other than looking a little too big um i guess i mean it's, it's obvious he looks a little too big just because he you know he has to conform to mario while also you know looking like paper mario so at, at least he works you know what i'm saying at least he works oh man okay so we're playing against robbie rotten here and uh we'll see what we can do probably nothing good because he is number one obviously he is number one okay just run into it i was reading a roll in but i guess i'll read a roll or an attempt to attack me too aka you'll just try and hit me okay i mean you saved me so that's fine i mean you didn't really save me because i was going to the ledge anyway he just sort of tried to punish me but at least now i was able to act out of it Okay, oh man, I wanted my jabs. I wanted my jabs. Okay, but I got that perfect shield on the egg. Ooh, I was going for a back air as well. Okay, cool, cool. Cool, alright. Let's charge up our Flood. Also, Flood goes inside of him, but just ignore that. Just pretend that doesn't exist. Okay, just pretend that doesn't exist. Nope. Nope. Oh man. I wanted, I wanted the, uh, I wanted a shield, but it didn't work. It didn't work. It's okay. It's okay. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Oh, man. No! Oh, that was gonna be a nice forward smash if it hit. Dang it. Dang it, dude. Dang it, dude. Okay, do I have my jump? I don't. Oh, what? My up B didn't come out? I was trying to up B him instead of up being on the stage. Like that. Except that was an accident. <laughs> but I'll take it. I'll take a footstool. Why not? It works for me. It works for me. It works for you. It works for everyone in the zoo. Oh, look at that zoom in. That's too. too his head is too big. It gets covered up by a bunch of stuff. But, uh, still cool looking mod, still cool looking mod. Alright, good stuff to you, Robbie. Hopefully Sporticus doesn't get you anytime soon. Now let's go fight somebody with Paper Luigi. These are made by two different people, by the way. So they're not gonna look like they match. Um, I actually believe that Paper Luigi, if I read the, uh, the description of the mod right, was originally from back in the brawl modding days and it's just been ported over and I and just you know for uh for smash 4 so um I mean it makes sense that they look different if they're made by different people especially because this is a mod that you can't exact it's not like a model swap or anything it's literally gotta be um oh man it's it's gotta be like originally made at least a little bit because uh, you can't take the flat model from the Paper Mario series and put it on Smash. It just doesn't work too well. Oh, man. Get out of my face with that side B nonsense. Oh, I wanted the Shoryuken. The Shoryuken. Okay. All right. I'll just throw out a fireball. Oh, alright. It forces his recovery to be high. I know that much. Oh, okay. I did not know that I would make it. The problem with m mods like this, where it makes the character a little bit bigger, is you don't actually know where your, um, where your body starts as far as the game goes. Because, you know, my head is not actually as high as Luigi's head is being shown here the game because it's still reading it as something different wait what what happened you can't do that can you did i hit him i must have hit him 
Or maybe he did a... Uh, or maybe he... Oh man, I'm dead. Oh no, I'm not. I have my jump still. Um, I did not think you could act out of a side B with an up B. Unless I hit him, in which case it gives him his ability to act it back. Or if he did the... The second hit of the side B. Maybe? But I don't think that gives it back to you either. Okay. Dang, I should have gone straight to ledge. That would have been s the safer option. Okay. Okay. It's okay. Oh, man! Okay. No! Oh. Dang. I'm surprised that sword didn't hit me at all. No! Stay away. Okay. No! Oh, I tried to act out. Alright. I, I mean, I didn't try to act out. I just tried to do something that would be helpful. Oh, good counter. Good counter. Good counter. Okay. Let's do this. He's just gonna keep dash attacking me, it seems like. Or is he dead? He's dead. Yeah! We did it. We did it. Good job, Ike. You, uh... You did something. Look, look at him. He's too big, too. Oh, okay. I guess when you zoom out, he's alright. But he still gets covered up by the two. I, I think maybe he's supposed to get covered up by the two. Um, I think that's normal. I, like, I think his normal model gets covered up, too. But that gets covered up more so, anyway, because he's gigantic. Alright, GG, Ike. GG. Oh, I didn't read your name. Sorry. But GG to that Ike player. Uh, you're lucky we didn't have Mario, because Mario would have been a lot easier to just cape a person. Cape, uh... Cape him when he's side being. You know? You know what I mean? Anyone who know, You guys know what I mean. You guys know what I mean. Alright, let's do one more with Paper Mario. And one more with Paper Luigi. Each. Just to show you guys a little bit. Ooh, we got the, uh... The... The... What's it called? The fighting ring? The boxing ring. Boxing ring. Alright. With the Rock Hawk battle, we got special Paper Mario music. Nice. You're dead, dude! You're dead. I honestly, I read- that was a read. A hard read. I was expecting him to do the side B because they love to do that. Oh, oh man. Okay. Stay away. Stay away! No. Alright. No! Okay, okay. Woo! Got him with that up B. Got him with that up B. Oh. See, the problem is with, Gan with, with Ganondorf is he's gonna be... Re he could kill me right now if he wanted. I figured that F-Smash was coming out any second now. Alright, let's go for a Flood Kill. Alright, he's gonna jump. Nice. Is he dead? No, he's not dead. Now he is. Now he is. Alright. You know, let's fight him with Luigi, too, because why not? That was a pretty simple fight. Pretty simple in my book, in my opinion, and my professional onion. My professional opinion. I don't know what I'm trying to say. But let's fight him with Paper Luigi, just to give him the, uh, the rude dog treatment. I don't know what that means. No! I did the wrong one! I did the wrong one! I'm gonna have to jump off and, and go select a new one. Okay, now that I'm not going too fast, let's see how we're gonna do in this fight. He chose King DDD last time, so I was hoping he wouldn't change, but uh, he did, and he went Charizard. I guess he likes the heavy fighters. Maybe he's doing a heavy fighter challenge or something? I don't know. Because he's been Ganondorf, King DDD, and Charizard, all of which are heavy fighters. Um, I actually think it's really funny that Charizard's the only... I'm trying to think of all the heavy fighters in this game. Oh, I guess Ike. Um, but, so I guess Charizard and Ike are, th are the only heavy fighters that aren't villains in their respective games. Because Bowser is the villain, King DDD is the villain at some point in the Kirby series, Ganon, of course, is the villain of the Zelda series, but then Charizard is just the starter Pokemon, and Ike is actually a main protagonist, so he's like the opposite of a bad guy. And Pokemon can't be bad guys unless you're talking about Mewtwo, but even then, he was just a misunderstood miscreant. Pokemon. Um, what other heavy fighters are there? I can't... I don't think there are any that are... Uh, in... I can't think of any more in Smash. Okay, you're dead. 
No, stay away from my face. I'll have to. I'd have to look at the character select screen to to be able to talk about it because I can't really think of any others. Can I? I'm trying. Like I'm trying to play and think at the same time, but also talk at the same time. And it doesn't really work out too well. Ike doesn't even seem too heavy, which is you know the thing about him. But he is. He's a he's a heavy fighter because he's got that broadsword. All right, again with some forward airs. I'm gonna go for a sure you can. Whenever he side bees, no. Oh, he's gonna side be at some point, and that will be my time to strike. Get out of here. Okay, okay, okay. At least I didn't up beat too far past him. Oh. Read that roll, got the shore you can, and Luigi's head is just sticking inside of the ground. But there we go. We did it. We won as Paper Luigi and Paper Mario at least once. I know that because I fought this guy twice and won twice. Um, so that, guys, is going to do it for this episode. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed the double mod, um, let me know because there are some that I can do that are like different pairings that I can show off. And yeah, that's going to be it for this video. Thank you all so much, and I will see you all next time. Have an awesome day.